Uh, Danny, difficult conditions out there, um, but a, a hard-fought win, and we, we did, really did have to fight hard for that one. Yeah, we did. Um, you know, I thought the first half was was pretty pretty even, um, and then uh, but I thought we did really well in the first half. Uh, and then you know we spoke half time about making sure that we we stayed to that tempo and and work rate and attitude. Uh, and then we've gone in front and and to be fair to uh, Westfield, you know they they really come at us, they really had a go. Um, but I have to say the way that we stuck together uh, as a group and, and defended as a group was was excellent. And obviously we've gone away at the end uh, and nicked one. But again, it's just I think it's just testament to the boys with their character uh, and how much that they wanna they wanna succeed. Yeah. And uh, defensively today, obviously our, our first clean sheet of the season, um, and, and defensively they they really earned it today. Uh, you had uh, Miles cleared one off the line, and I think Jules uh, right back today, um, two really good uh, clearances, and yeah. and uh, Ollie with a, a really good tracking back tackle. So they they really worked hard. Yeah, they did. That's what, that's what I'm saying. I, I, you know, the back four did really well, but the boys just in front of them as well worked worked hard. They all, they all worked hard. They all had to dig in. Uh, digging deep, and, and that's exactly what they've done. And uh, based based off of that, for me, um, yeah, the, the, the three points was was deserved. But I say after obviously Wednesday night's result uh, uh, in the cup, it was important that we got a reaction uh, and that we got a win to get back on to, on you know on track. And uh, we asked them that question before the game, uh, and, uh, and they've gone and proved proved it. Yeah. And how hard is it to uh, kind of differentiate cup results from league results? Obviously now we're, we're on a really good run in the league still. Um, and, and is it possible to just sort of put the, the cup results to one side like that? Yeah, I think so. Uh, you know, we, we, I think it's a case of, um, you know, we'd, we'd won five or six on the, on the bounce and we went top of the league last Saturday. And I think, you know, as much as you, you try and, you know, speak to them about it, don't get complacent, uh, I think that's a little bit what happened. Uh, again, no different from the rugby, I, I think. Uh, you know, you look at rugby today, all you ever heard from everywhere was England was going to win, was going to win, and you know, it, what, what happened happened. And I, and I just think when that when that starts to get into players, it, it, it can become uh, subconsciously, it can become a little bit of a mindset that you know we just got to turn up. And I think that's what happened on Wednesday. So it was important today that, as I say, we got a, we got a performance and, and we stuck together, uh, and, and that's what we did. Uh, so another cup game uh, again coming up midweek. Um, is, is is this something that uh, you know you, you think we can go on to win? Uh, well, we want we cup? want we want to. You know, it's, it's not like we're treating these cups like they're like they're nothing. Uh, we we want to we want to go on and win, uh, especially the Essex Senior Cup. You know, all local sides that, that you're playing against. Um, so yeah, we'll, we'll go into Tuesday's game looking looking to win it like we always look to win every game. Obviously, the, the, the side will have to change slightly because of the, the South End boys are. Playing the Essex Senior Cup for, for Southend, um, but that's what sports all about, and, and it gives other people opportunities to come in, um, get some minutes, and, and to show and say, look, I should be I should be in the side. So it's all positives, uh, and, and yeah, we're looking forward to the game Saturday. Yeah, that's Tuesday. Yeah. And uh, defensively, they're going to be forced into other changes as, as well, because Ollie obviously is going to now miss a couple of games due to that that red card. Yeah, so he can play Tuesday, um, but he, he's, he's banned from next Saturday and, and Tuesday. Again, um, Next Tuesday against Way, yeah. And do you, do you think we've got the, the squad okay to, to cover that? Uh, obviously, at left back today, um, we uh, we didn't have Yannick, um, so that was kind of a filling yeah. that gap. Yeah, Yannick, Yannick, Yannick wasn't well today, unfortunately, but I thought Elwin done done brilliant there. Um, he played there before, but it was it was a long time ago, and I thought he he, he sat in there really well, did his job. Um, so yeah, you can't really you can't really argue. But as I say, that's what the squad the squad is all about. Um, and, and, and players have got to step up and fill, fill the gaps when, when needed.